Never forgotten game, ninth annual, Saugatuck and Fenville raising money. 12 AEDs donated that puts the West Center Heart team to over a thousand. Brody Peterson, nice lob for Dylan Scott. Fenville took a three-point lead into the half. Third quarter, Saugatuck down six. Thomas Beckman to Lucas Zarnecki. He hit the three, and we got a three-point ball game, but too much Peterson tonight. Of course, that's because there's two of them for Fenville, but Brody with the driving layup. Fenville wins at 53 to 40. Chris Gorski has more from Blackhawk Country. Brody Peterson with 17 for the Blackhawks. They get the win 53-40 here tonight. But this game about so much more than basketball as the community continues to remember Wes Leonard. It means a lot to me personally. You know, I was here the night that Wes passed. And, you know, seeing that, it's like you, you want to be here. You want to represent them well. You want to do, you want to get the win for Fenwick. He was what you would want to be as, as a person. Like, he never talked trash. He was humble. He, he worked hard in and out of practice and everything. So just trying to play like him. You hear about it all the time now in the media, um, how this kid went down, but he was able to come back simply because of this awareness now. And the community, I think it really brings in the community together. It's been, I think, almost 10 years, almost, I think and it still hasn't lost that effect. Always an emotional night here at the Never Forgotten Game, and Wes Leonard's legacy continues to be raising awareness and donating AEDs to organizations in need. They gave away 12 of those here tonight. Fenville gets the win. They improved to 8-1 on the season. They continue next Tuesday when they play at Hackett. From Fenville High School, I'm Chris Gorski for the Fox 17 Blitz.